Hagin, Erev Shabbos Hagin, Erev Yom Kippur Habalin, Lulu Toiva. You know, no rabbi ever gets up on uh, Yom Kippur and Eilah and says, you know, Chavra today is Mamash like Purim. On Purim, everyone's yelling that it's like Yom Kippur. But it's true. The Rizal says there's two sides of the same coin. There's Purim and Yom Kippur. Chatz Lechem and Chatz Lashem. When Rabbi Yitzchak Berkowitz Shlita was in the Mir, so they once had a three day Purim. Purim was shown like this here, Bez Roshab, Tavshim Pei Hei. And uh, normally the guys would go out to different, their own Sudas. But this year they decided to Purim and Shulash, everyone, all the Bachim are going to stay in Yeshiva. Kachava, everyone committed, they stayed in Yeshiva for Purim and Shulash. Someone donated crates of wine. They were hammered for three days straight. It was moving. On, uh, on Yom Risha and on, 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 on Sunday after Shabbos, the last day of Purim and Shulash, all the Avrech and the Kudal Yongalite, they came to join after their Suda. And uh, Yeshiva got aboard in a band. It's very good. One of the Avrech, very close of here. He jumps up on a table, which is a minute of a sinner bed day no problem. And he yells, Chevra, I fell asleep. Uh, he's drunk, yes. And he said, Elio, Adagilu Elio. He came to me and he told me that the reason I was right. But we got it mixed up. Purim, what's a year gonna do drunk for three days? It's cool, Elashem. Kipper, you know what it feels like walking out from Yom Kippur? That's cool, Elohim. Yom Kippur is the most beautiful, purest day. Sometimes we get lost in uh, our sense of guilt and, and all the various that, that, you know, are, are weighing on us. But Shalom wants us to take steps forward, to get our heads screwed on straight. Yom Kippur is the purest day of the year. In Ger, their minig is that they rush through Vidoy. Right? Everyone in class will sing Vidoy in a happy tune. Yeah? Yom Kippur is a pure and beautiful day. The, the Gary Rabbi used to say, it's no day to get dirty. You don't, you don't, you don't play around in the mud. We fly through Vidoy. The Iker the Iker is the purity and the beauty of Yom Kippur and the, the tremendous kapar that the Bani Shalom is, is granting us. It's an incredibly happy day. And someone finds himself chas v'chalil and atzvah, he missed the boat. So someone just pointed out to me, the Shabbos, Yubitzi Fisher, the Mari de Gazog, and Nasana Toikif, which is like, like, the one part of Yom Kippur where, you know, no one's jolly. This is, this is the time to be intense. Yeah, nice with the Ramna. It's an intense, intense part of Davin. Even there, we say that Klai Yisrael are walking, every, 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 not just Klai Yisrael, everyone, the Malachim, they're, they're shaking up in Shemayim. Why? Because where everyone passes by the Rebbe Shalom, Kibnei Moroin. Like sheep. Now think about it, says Rebbe Think about it. What is the shepherd doing as his sheep are walking by? What is that procedure? That this marshal, this intense marshal is, it's a beautiful marshal. The shepherd is making sure that his sheep are okay. He's making sure that they don't have any boo-boos. He's making sure they're not walking backwards. He's making sure that their heads are screwed on straight. He's checking them one by one a full inspection to take care of them. He cares about us. We are, we, we are, we are he, the marshal is the shepherd and we are his sheep. It would be, it would be absolutely wrong and disgraceful to uh, approach the day in any other way. If a friend Waxman says a mice of a child who was back in, in Hungary and uh, he, special, special treat, the Rebbe chipped, uh, chipped in, he got a couple of, he got a, a sponsor and he saved up a few uh, kopecks and he bought the kids cake for Rosh Chodesh, a very special treat. And his tired little Yanko says, you know what, my father barely eats, he gives me all his food and cake, he never eats cake. It would be such a beautiful treat if I could bring this to my tante. So he says, I'm saving the cake. And he wraps it in a little napkin and he puts it in his bag and he puts it in his cubby. I'm saving it for my tante. Can you imagine? Zisa, Zisa, kid. The kids are on my so Comes recess and uh, Yanko gets a little hungry. And the thought of cake is just like, like, I gotta have a piece of cake. So he goes, he looks, he looks in the bag. He's like, okay, I'll take a peek. I think, you know, I think, I'll nibble, a nibble, Tati won't notice. And he takes a little piece, fine. Next comes recess, the next break. He, the Rebbe goes out for two minutes. He runs his bag, takes another little bite. By the time he comes home, there's two big bites missing from the cake. And he's like, oh no, oh no. This is like the thing I'm bringing my Tati, and you know? he's gonna hop, there's two bites. So he hands it to his father crying. He says, I'm sorry. I took a bite out of the cake. It was supposed to be a present. His father cries. Burst out crying. 
says, Tai Yanko, I see how hard it was for you not to, eat, to, to, not to eat this cake. I see how much you struggled and how delicious this cake is for you. And you still saved me some. This is the most precious piece of cake I ever had. It's true, we do have favorites. It's true, we take bites. We're biting Shalalem, and there's never been a dar where it's easier to do Averis, when it's harder not to do Averis. It's impossible. But we're bringing the Bode Shalom our, our cake. And we're bringing, we're saying, I, I know, I, I, I shouldn't have taken a bite out of it. I didn't want it. It breaks my heart that I did. But we're bringing the Bode Shalom the cake. And there's nothing more beautiful than the cake. The Bode Shalom chops how hard it was, how many bites of cake we didn't take. And yeah, and yeah. The Bershom says, Salachti Kitvarecha, you're good. That would be Zechit to walk into Yom Kippur with the proper mindset, to get to, to have the full Slicha, Mechila, Kapara, to, to enjoy the purity and the Kippur came of the day and carry it with us for the entire year, which would be a year of Bracha and Atzlacha and Shalom and Achdos and Mashiach to Kenim and Mehrev Yameinu. Kishab Besaget Yom Tiv. In Tachane, Oi, Machane, Oi, 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 Good job,